These are the Stanbaugh Coke ovens. They're located between um, Ferguson and uh, Mount Braddock, Lamont Furnace area. Um, these are really good preserved examples that you can't necessarily see from the road. I'm not sure of their vintage. I believe they operate into the 1930s, but it's like a two bank system here. I'll show you the other side, a little bit more blown out, but uh, um, really good example of you know what Coke ovens look like from the front. It's almost in good enough shape that you could um, almost have a driving tour through here because the old uh, rail line uh, ran through here. They go back a pretty far distance and then uh, the path there was probably how the railroad ran through to load the coke into the ovens. The other side uh, is a little bit more weather and environmentally damaged. Something you don't see very often on an oven setup is, I'll call it the, the end, which is like a cap. Um, made of uh, stone block, but this the cap is still intact here, which is really nice. I'll swing around here and show it to you. Um, there's a like a pier or something on the end that might have uh, been kind of like a coal tipple that loaded on there. I'm not really sure. Um, as I walk over here. Um, I see another kind of moss-covered um, pier here with bolts in the bottom, so it would be interesting to see what the setup was. Uh, but it probably did feed the coal over to the uh, ovens there. So, uh, as you can see with the green leaves in the uh, front, this will be one of my last filmings of coke ovens this year because they get buried in the woods again.